Well, you know, obviously, I, I imagine um, the emotions are are you know pretty pretty big right now. I mean, what you know, it's still a great season. What I guess, kind of, what are the emotions that you're experiencing well, right now? You know, I'm supposed to be the the adult and be able to put things in perspective right away, but um, it's tough when you um, put a lot into it and um, go through the amount of hours and um, all of the. Um, the work that goes into it, all the time spent, all the memories, and um, it's, it, it ends quick. And, um, you know, it's, it's hard to put the motion aside, but I told the girls just now that, you know, tomorrow they're going to wake up, the sun will come up, they're going to realize all the things that we accomplished. And it was a heck of a year, and, I mean, I'm just, I'm, I'm extremely proud of them. I was going to say, I mean, you kind of touched on it, but anything else you want to add? Because it's been a great season for you guys. You accomplished so much, and um, obviously you don't want to let just this one thing, you know, get in the way of, of all of the stuff right. that you accomplished. Well, I mean, school records, I mean, nine-hole record, 18-hole record, invitational win, Badger Conference Championship. Um, I mean, those, those are things that will be in the record books in the trophy case forever, so those can never be taken away from them no matter what happened today. Um, so, I mean, that's, that's something that eventually will write the book in this season. Um, collectively, the girls struggled on the, on the back nine, and, and obviously, you know, they had, the, you know, they had a, lead, a little bit of a lead at the turn. W- what was it, do you think, that, you know, that maybe caused some, some problems? Because I don't think any of them knew really where no. they were, so, I, you know, I don't think it was, um, you know, pressure or anything like that. I mean, what was it, do you think, on the backside that they just struggled a little bit? Well, you know, I, I think that even though we didn't, we, we tried to hide uh, what they were doing, they, they can put uh, four scores together and realize those are pretty four, scout, uh, four solid scores. So I'm sure they had an idea that we were doing real well. Um, you know, I guess the back, uh, back nine, I guess we just didn't show a lot of the emotional, uh, mental toughness that we've shown all year. And, uh, you know, we ended up with 18 shots worse in the back nine, and um, that was a difference. I mean, um, you got to really give a lot of credit to Oregon and Wanakee because they put together a couple of really nice back nines. and. Um, you know that that's 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 what it comes down to, and we just we just couldn't get the job done on the back nine today. As far as um, Sammy getting to state, you know, I, I just talked to her, and, and you know, it's got to be a little bit bittersweet for for her, for you, for the team, for her, you know, for her to get to state is a great individual accomplishment, you know, but to not obviously do it as a team. I mean, what are your emotions well, surrounding her you accomplishment? Know, well, Sammy is such a team player. I mean, that's Sam, that was Sammy's number one goal coming in as well. So. Uh, we all stood together, but you can't take anything away from what Sammy did out there. I mean, she put together a pretty solid round of golf in tough conditions. Um, she's been our leader all year long, and, and she led us again today. So, um, you know, it, yeah, it's hard. I mean, it's very hard. Then she went out there and had to go into a playoff. So um, that shows you kind of a character check right there. She went from the emotions in about five minutes of not knowing where we stood, turning in her scorecard, realizing we didn't make it as a team, Realize that she made it as an individual and go play off uh, for a medal. So, um, you know, that just kind of shows what she's got in her. Um, you know, I'm never, I would never doubt her. I would never doubt anything that she did. She's not apparently feeling all too well either. So, I mean, to play through, um, like you said, the pressure and also not feeling the best to, right. to make it back to state. Yeah, and she's known to, she'll never make excuses. But, yeah, she was sick. She couldn't practice yesterday. Um, so, I mean, that's just another thing to, go, I mean, to fight through it. That's one more thing in your mind, and I think she was able to put those out and really stay focused and really put together a solid round of golf. Um, uh, and then, I guess, just finally, that you know, Jade, Jade golfed really well again. Um, you know, she struggled a little bit on the, on the backside, but still an 88. You know, what, what, what about Jade's performance today that, that got her that 88? Well, I, I was really proud of Jade. Jade had, Jade had a great uh, freshman year for us, and... Um, to come together and put together a round in the 80s. There wasn't a lot of rounds in the 80s out here today, so um, she certainly w- w- helped us. And um, I really was was proud of the way that she was able to handle herself on the back nine. I know that she was visibly nervous, and um, she got a little bit out of her routine, and we talked about staying in her pre-shot routine. And um, I think she was able to really kind of put that beside her and, and finish strong on the, on, on, the, on the back nine. And overall, just a solid round of golf. And Finally, I mean, anything else that you want to add? Well, Lauren Gaffney, I mean, that's, Lauren Gaffney's been unbelievable for us all year, and it's just, this is always a hard part because all of a sudden it's done, four years and it's done, and um, she's come a long way, and uh, she's got great character, and she's going to do a lot of great things in life, and we're, we're really 
I couldn't be any happier to have been around her for the last four years. Awesome. Congratulations on a great season. Thanks.